In this question, we're given a discrete time signal and we're asked to find its energy. So remember, the energy of a signal is simply the summation over all time of the signal squared. So that would have been integral if it was a continuous time signal and it's a summation in the case of a discrete time signal. So we simply replace, instead of x of n, we put in the expression we're given. We're given some constant, 1 over 3 to the power n, u of n squared. So these powers multiply, so we end up with 1 over 3 to the power 2n times u of n squared. But we know that a unit step, well, if you square it, you still get a unit step, because the unit step is just 1. I drew the continuous version. If you were to draw a discrete time version, it would be the same. You'd have values of 1, which, when squared, are still 1. So uh, the unit step squared is the same as the unit step. So now we have our expression for the energy. We look at what we're given in the question. We're given that this geometric series will converge to 1 over 1 minus a. And this geometric series looks very much like that. OK, so they look similar. So what we could do is simplify ex just a little bit. It'll look like this, 1 over 3 squared to the power n, u of n. And now that looks very much like that. So I can even, if you like, write it like this. So it's a summation from k equals 0 to infinity of 1 over 9 to the power n, or to the power k. So 1 over 9, that is my value for a. That's that value there. So that will converge to 1 over 1 minus 1 over 9. And we could simplify that, or we could leave it. So you could say it's 9 over 8. And that would be your final answer.